Hey there, we the Geo guys have come up with the first video explaining everything about Varda, an unforgettable cyclone in the year 2016. Starting from the cyclone formation first, taking birth on the 3rd of December 2016 as a low pressure in the Malay Peninsula, it transformed to a depression on the 6th and later to a deeper one on the 7th. It was given the name Varda by our neighboring country Pakistan which meant Red Rose. On 8th of December, it became a cyclonic storm and travelled westwards. It intensified on the next two days and became a very severe cyclonic storm. Its speed was 130 km per hour and its pressure about 975 millibars. How fast was that? Coming to the sad part, Vardha made its landfall in the shore of Tamil Nadu at around afternoon on the 12th of December. Its eye was 20 km off Chennai and it was a category 2 cyclone. It was a severe cyclonic storm with a wind speed of about 105 km per hour then. Karnataka experienced rains on the 13th of December. But Vardha could no longer move on. It became a low pressure area dissipated in the Somalian lands on the 19th of December. So let me now tell you some of the preparations taken by the government in order to have some precautions for the cyclone. 16,000 people were evacuated from the risk prone areas in advance. Indian armed forces were ready to spring in action. 15 teams of the NDRF were employed in the coastal regions. The blunt of the cyclone was massively faced by Tamil Nadu and also in the other states of the southern India. So let me give you some of the impacts that they had faced. The storm surge was about 6 to 8 meters. 167 millimeters of rainfall in the Andaman and Nicobar Islands and so 1400 tourists were stranded though they were later rescued by the Indian Navy. The total casualties were about 134. One lakh trees were uprooted. 10,000 electric poles and 800 transformers were damaged. 22,573 crore rupees was the loss that had happened to the government. 10 casualties due to the events of the storm. So as you can see, the cyclone has created a lot of damage for the areas that were affected and still some people aren't able to recover from the trauma due to the cyclone. And yet again, we're back to the same situation now. But I'm sure the world is gonna battle back and come back to normal. And until then, thank you for watching this video. And before you close the window, please do not forget to like, share and subscribe to our channel. And to stay updated, do hit the bell icon. Stay home, stay safe.